Thank you. With so many people leaving the Carolinas to escape Hurricane Florence, cities in neighboring states like Georgia and Tennessee have been welcoming evacuees. Channel 3 meteorologist Nick Austin spoke to one group about how they're helping. Nick? Well, David, the Chattanooga Convention and Visitors Bureau has become a hub of information for evacuees coming to the scenic city. They've helped people find lodging and things to do while they wait to go back home. Hurricane Florence made landfall Friday morning, but most people who evacuated the Carolinas have been long gone. Some of them have ended up in the scenic city, according to Barry White of the Chattanooga Convention and Visitors Bureau. He's received a lot of phone calls this week. What we see is, you know, that push through Georgia, and every time one town fills up, they go to the next one and the next one. So Atlanta was the, you know, the last really big city before uh, getting up here. The Bureau is working with the Tennessee Hospitality and Travel Association and other organizations to help find places for people to stay. With hotels just trying to monitor what kind of what type of availability they have and then the state can work with our visitor centers at the state line. White can't guarantee substantial discounts but hopes hotel and motel owners are aware of state laws. Not to gouge, not to raise prices up, even to go with like a lower kind of standard government rate or some things like that. The Visitors Bureau has also been partnering with local attractions like the Tennessee Aquarium to offer lower price tickets. White says it helps the evacuees take their minds off the stressful times since they don't know how long they'll be here. He also says Tennesseans understand what people are going through and want to help in times of need. So I think Chattanoogans will you know, do step up and whether it's hotels, restaurants, people they come in face to face with and just recognize that need. Now for evacuees who have not contacted the Visitors Bureau, we'll have their contact information inside the WRCB app or you can call them at 1-800-322-3344. Live in the studio, I'm meteorologist Nick Austin, Channel 3 Eyewitness News. Nick, we want to thank you for that report. And